Hello everyone, this is Ross at Teacher Toolkit. This is idea number six of a series of 30 videos I'm sharing to support teachers through the summer term. Um, it's examination revision season. Um, a lot of students' research shows that students largely go online to listen to music, particularly at age 16 years old. Um, at age six, research suggests that students uh, of age six go online to play games. So, think about the age of students that you teach. Why are they using, you know, what are they going online for, you know, particularly to revise? Um, you know, John Hattie, well-cited research, and again, context is key here, different settings, particularly when we get research headlines. But his visible learning research suggests that if students listen to background music, um, it has a 0.10 impact on student outcomes. So I've toyed with all these ideas throughout my teaching career, um, let students listen to music, sometimes then sis said no, because it causes a problem, then I put a radio on in the corner, um, it's either rap music or classical music, I've tried them all. Um, but ultimately it doesn't work, because you know, if you look at their cognition, psychology, or what research also suggests, when a student comes to sit an exam, they're going to be in an examination hall with a desk and a chair, totally far, you know, far removed from the environment where they've learnt to recall and retrieve information from long-term memory. So it's essential in your classroom that you avoid anything that is totally different to a situation where students um, will need to recall this information. So for example, if a year 11 sticks his hand up and says, Miss, sir, can I listen to some music while I revise? I promise to be good. Um, the answer's got to be no, because research shows it doesn't work and it won't support them in the exam hall. Uh, find out more on teachertoolkit.co.uk or reply to this video and I'll point you in the direction of all the research I've quoted. Uh, good luck for the exam season.